when I have spare time, I love travel. I often, no matter long distance or short distance, I love to explore all the different sceneries and the different culture, and that all gave me a lot of imaginations and the creative way of thinking. Especially, I love to come to the beach. The water flow, they have a rhythm with the wave. Like when we play music, when we play a melody, we need to naturally to flow with that the music directions. Music note directions flow in our finger. When I was first introduced to piano, my mom didn't force me to actually learn piano. It was because I wanted to learn it. I love piano especially because it's really a part of you when you play. It's not only just your hands playing, it's your heart's connected to it, your mind's into it, your feet and your hands. They're all used to play the piano. They're all thinking differently, but they're still interconnected in such a way that makes music sound so beautiful. And that's how great piano is. I, I love my mom for introducing it to me. So when we play the piano, no matter how the dynamic of the waves, we should play as our heart goes the match with the sound of the waving sound. I started learning piano two years ago with Miss Felicia. We started polishing together. I learned all about my emotions and how I'm supposed to use it. I like her classes because she's very patient with me when I make mistakes. Miss Felicia, even though she's my teacher, she's a friend of mine. And I like playing piano because when I play the piano, I feel very relaxed and happy. With Felicia, she's sometimes strict, but then she get me to what I want to achieve. I like playing piano originally more as a hobby, but then now it's become more of kind of like a career, I guess. And so at first I didn't really like piano and I felt like it was kind of boring. But then after I came here, Felicia reintroduced piano to me in like kind of like a new way. And she really let me kind of just fall in love with piano and I want to spread this feeling to more people. I've learned piano with Mrs. Zhang for seven years. I've played at Carnegie Hall multiple times and that really allows me to gain confidence playing in front of so many people. Learning with Mrs. Zhang really changed my life because I really enjoy playing the piano much more now. I love hearing my music when I play my notes. And my teacher is amazing and kind and thoughtful. And I love playing notes with her. She has a method that's unlike any piano teaching method I've seen before. I think what makes her different is she takes a very holistic approach to each student. She gets to know them, their likes, their dislikes, what gets them to want to practice the piano. And it really opened up a whole new perspective for me on what piano education entails. It's not just learning to read the notes. There's a kind of geometry that she was teaching. It's one that they picked up on really quickly. And so they were able to play entire songs almost immediately. Our life should be continually study, learning, no end. If you keep on practicing piano, then you can become really good at it, like my mom. And learning from her has been actually really fun. I'm not saying it like it's surprising, because piano is fun. So as younger children, because they're natural, I always follow them, because they haven't really learned how to analyze what is a good way, what is a bad way, they only directly just feel this. I think he learned self-control and persistence, and of course, you know, a lifelong skill set that he will treasure for the rest of his life. I love Mrs. Zhang because she always plays some pieces and then she lets me choose which one's my favorite. And the one that I choose will 
be challenging and she'll accept the challenging piece. I think the piano helped him a lot. At the beginning, Felicia gave him a lot of challenge work. After that, he's very confident to do other stuff such as hockey, soccer, and basketball. She's very dedicated to her art and I recommend her to everyone who wants the kid to perform and have great performance in the school and also in the music art. Our life should be something like all the waters. It always flow, never stop. We always lifelong study, lifelong experience, lifelong feel. Feel the key, feel the touch, feel the music. Life is like a piano. What you get out of it depends on how you play it.